It is already easy to buy almost anything with just one click or tap and now tech giants, tech company giants are beginning to enter a new online shopping battle centered around AI. Ivan Rodriguez reports on the race to add AI power to shopping, uh, shopping tools to their services and how some are already being used today. Ivan, this is so fascinating. I mean, we're literally in a different time now. Annie, a, a battle is definitely brewing. Google, Amazon, and OpenAI are moving quickly to add new AI tools to their services, all of them aiming to play a critical role in one of the fundamental things people do online, shop. With consumers increasingly using AI to make purchases, experts say companies like Amazon and Google are trying to stay ahead of upstarts like OpenAI and Perplexity. There are a lot of different big tech companies that we're talking about who are trying to leverage AI. For example, as of September, U.S.-based users can buy Etsy products directly from OpenAI's ChatGPT. OpenAI and Walmart announced a similar partnership in October. Perplexity's Comet web browser lets users set up AI agents to handle tasks like shopping on Amazon. Last month, Amazon sent a cease and desist letter to the AI startup. For Jeremy Goldman, it's a sign that an AI battle is brewing. Amazon is one of the biggest players, unsurprisingly, in this regard. Uh, one thing that they're trying to do quite a lot of is to facilitate extra transactions and to reduce the friction for the consumer. AI and online agents are expected to be involved in $73 billion worth of global online sales, or 22% of all orders placed, from Tuesday through Cyber Monday, according to Salesforce data provided exclusively to CNN. Recently, Google announced new AI shopping features, including an AI agent able to call local stores and ask if a product is in stock, along with information about promotions and pricing. With all the new AI tools, Goldman says consumers will need time to adapt. At one point, the idea of clicking an ad on Google and clicking through and then transacting, that was strange to people. And now that's something people don't even think about. Platforms like Google and Amazon still have major advantages thanks to the ecosystems they've built around their products like Amazon Prime. For example, 66% of Americans haven't used ChatGPT, while 20% say they haven't heard of it, according to the Pew Research Center. Live in Atlanta, I'm Ivan Rodriguez.